rock steady at King of the Pit TV. Yes, now bless now people. We're sipping tonight. Might get started on this song, might not. Who knows? But we're on track number four of eleven. I already know this is going to be a very, very, very easy listen of a record. All right. This one's Cape Cod, Quasa Quasa. What that means, I have no idea. Self-titled Vampire Weekend. Let's go. Th these dudes definitely draw influence from world music. Now, I've always found world music quite ignorant, the title of it, world music, because there's more to the world than what we know in the Western world, but that's simply what I got taught in music class, world music. Little harmony, double guitars. The keyboard player just has such a awesome uh, presence within the act. There's only got to be one guitarist, right? And the vocalist, does he play an instrument or does he stand alone? Let's work that out. Does the vocalist play the keyboard by any chance? Here we are. Come on. There's that kick, come on. It's been a while since I listened to Arcade Fire. I listened to the Arcade Fire record um, Funeral on this channel a bit back. Am I right in assuming there's a parallel between both of these acts? Sound-wise, is there a little bit of a crossover? Am I right in saying that? This was a good tune. Weakest one so far, though. 
But it was a good tune. The standard is high. M79 coming up next. Quite a long one at 4 minutes 15. Track number 5, okay? Let's move on. Right now, 